how to verify your Shopify domain on Facebook Business Manager. For that purpose, we are going to head over to our Shopify store. Now, from here, we're going to head over to our settings and we are going to click on domains and we're going to make sure that our domain is primary. So this is our domain over here, which is this one. We're going to click on it and we're going to simply just copy our domain. This is our your primary domain. People usually tend to have multiple different domains or they have uh, different domains, but this is ours. We're going to only select this one. Make sure it's your primary domain. Now we're going to head over to Facebook Business Manager, which is a meta business suit. And from here, we are going to select domain settings. Let's head over to settings and domains under the brand safety here. We're going to head over to domains here. And we're going to click on add and we're going to create a new domain. Let's do that. Create a new domain. We're going to paste that domain. And once we do that, we're going to paste the specific custom domain from Shopify that we've copied. We're going to click on add and it's successfully added. Now we will need to choose to verify it. Now, since we've added it, now the big question remains, which is how do we verify it? We're going to choose meta tag verification and copy it by clicking. This is the meta tag verification over here. Let's just copy it. And then we're going to head over to Shopify to verify it. And we're going to go to Shopify back again, head back our online store right here. And from here, we're going to work with our themes now into the theme sections. We're going to select this part and we're going to click on edit code. Now under this layout, we're going to look out for theme liquid and you're going to have to search for meta over here and look for the head html tag to create a new line and then we're going to paste what we copied from meta over here this is the head html line let's create a different line and over here we're going to simply paste it and click enter so click on save and let's head back over to facebook and click verify which is the verification we're going to click on verify domain if this does not verify ever performing the query you're going to wait a couple minutes to verify that again let's work with this delete this and save this up again asset is save you go up here you click on verification verify this domain if it still fails you're going to take a couple minutes clear the facebook cache and verify this again and it should work 